Hey guys, and welcome to a new series that I've been thinking about doing for some time. I have loads of games, too many games, too many games that I will ever actually um, have time to record. And I've got a lot of weird games as well. Games that I'm not even sure how I um, <laughs> came into ownership of. So, I thought about doing another series. I don't know how often I'm going to do these, maybe twice a week. I'm going to select a game at random. And we're going to find out whether it's a turd or whether it's treasure by giving the game, say, half an hour, maybe an hour, um, mostly blind. These games are going to be a mix of games that I guess I haven't played for either a very, very, very long time or have never played. Or maybe I'll look at some old classics or something. I don't know. We're just basically going to pick a game, throw it on and see what it's like. First up, we have Die Hard Vendetta for the GameCube. I don't remember ever buying this, and usually I don't buy a game if it's not complete. This game is not complete. So, interesting. It came from HMV. Is that HMV? No, I think it's the old game sticker there. So, holy shit. This must be a lot, very old. I mean, it's a GameCube game, huh? But, yeah, interesting. So, this is actually a unique story. The John McClane, yes, yes, the Christmas hero uh, of our time. Time for a little payback. Take on the role of heroic cop John McClane to protect and rescue innocent Los Angeles citizens. All right. Uh, and his daughter. Oh, yeah, I can't forget his daughter, Lucy. As the original non-stop action-packed Die Hard storyline unfolds, uh-oh, use your wits and everything else at your disposal to blast your way through LA's seedy underworld. Game features weaponry. Well, that's positive. Dual weapons for more firepower and an awesome arsenal, including night vision goggles. Okay, cool. A sniper rifle. Well, that's nice, I guess. Submachine guns and more. Hmm. They're actually listing a sniper rifle as a feature. Okay. Advanced... AI, hold your asses here, guys. Enemies hide behind corners when reloading and react differently according to where they're hit. Be careful. They will not think twice about killing hostages if you make a wrong move. Huh. Stealth ge- uh-oh. Uh-oh, it's a stealth game, apparently. Stealth gameplay. Take enemies captive to save civilian hostages. Ah. Uh. Okay, usually not very good at stealth games. Uh, this game came out in 2002. So pretty early release uh, on the GameCube's, uh, on the GameCube there. It has got the original Nintendo seal of quality. I don't know if my camera's going to pick that up. Yeah, yeah, but there we go. So, I mean, Nintendo said this was a pretty fucking good game. So, you know, I mean, they're hardly ever wrong, right? Uh, I did look it up. This game apparently tanked, and apparently it's a big old load of shit, but let's have a look. Let's go for new game. Um, let's actually switch scenes, because that might help. We're going to go for uh, new game. I guess we don't really have a lot of options here. We've got game credits, but nobody gives a fuck about that. New game. We can die hard, die harder, or die hardest. Um... I don't know. I don't know. Let's go for Die Harder, I guess. This is a stealth game, so... <laughs> yeah. Low violence? No. Wait a minute. I'm confused. Does low violence mean we're going to get, like, no gore? We want all the gore. I'm sure that's fine. Um, we can uh, change his appearance, which just flips what side the, the gun is on. Um, sure. That's fine. We can change our crosshair, though. That's fancy. Let's have something that looks really murderous. Uh, I mean, they're all a bit shit, really. Let's just go with that. Controller configuration. I'm sure it's fine, you know. Let's start the game. Oh, God, we've got training. Should we do the training? That'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? Let's go for our police training. Not that I think John McLean needs any training. Refresh a course for testing your police skills. Hmm. Excellent. Good evening. Oh. The instructor is waiting. <laughs> Who walks into the office with a fist out? 
<laughs> right, we're gonna fuck some shit up. Let's go straight on through those doors behind <laughs> that's me. fucking brilliant. Whoa, what the fuck? What is that? Oh, that's awful. Okay. <laughs> you can open a door by standing in front of it and pressing the action button. <laughs> oh my god, guys, we make sure you're <laughs> facing the door when you We get a lecture. Oh, not only do we walk into work with our fists out. <laughs> <laughs> the secretary of all things is giving us an instruction um, Press the action button on how to open doors. Oh, this is glorious. Simply stand in thank front you, of the thank you, thank you. I'm sorry, I've, I have recovered from the brain hemorrhage. You don't want to keep your instructor Look at waiting, the door John. And press the action button. Okay, now John's <laughs> John's actually speaking it out in his own head now. At least I I hope that that was John. Uh, what? Sorry, guy. I need coffee for this. Holy shit. Um, I mean, I expected some shit, but this is rather wonderful so far. <sighs> what have we got ourselves into today? There you go, John. <laughs> there you go, John. You opened the door. Excellent. I'm sure we're the right man for the job. Hey, have you got any doors that need opening? How you doing, John? Let's John's your man. Join me on the other side of that door. <laughs> okay, you really, you really trust John with a gun. You've just given him instructions on how to open a door. Now you're going to give him a firearm. Ah, <sighs> yippee ki yay, motherfuckers, I suppose. You're right okay, there, pal. First, you'll need a gun. I've placed a 9mm pistol in this bin. In the bin. You can open the bin by actioning, actioning on it. Pick up the gun inside by moving near it. Try yes. it now. Make sure you look at the object you're trying to open. Okay, you can look around using the C stick. Oh god. Ten bullets in this Thank gun. you. The more accurate you're shooting, the higher Oh the god, we're being scored. Shit. Okay. Um Oh god. It's Do we get more points for shooting in the dome? No, I don't Ooh, think so. Unlucky. That was almost a perfect unlucky. score. We can, okay, let's move we can on. Get a perfect score. Can I have another go? Or do you want me to open some more doors? Ah, uh, fine. Whenever you're ready. Jim. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Sorry, I've just had a Let's brain hemorrhage. Gun. Same rules apply. The gun is in the bin. Take Why it do now. you keep throwing guns in the bin? This weapon is less accurate, unless you use the manual target, but it has a much greater rate of What's fire. What's the manual target? We still got six shots. Holy shit. Um, let's just. P oh fuck! I was gonna say we're just pushing random buttons to see what happens, and no, put the fists away, jo John. Seriously, dude. There we go. Alright, let's see if we can get some a decent score. I can't actually... Like, it's very responsive. Like, the controls are really twitchy. Seriously. Like, one flick of the stick, it's, it's really kind of well mapped. I don't know if that's good or not. We're going to have to test. It feels very much an old school... Bad, but you could do better. Old school okay, approach to mapping the... Uh, the aiming. Let's go there. Yeah, not bad, buddy. Uh, can I have another go? Because yes, done, okay. We don't have to open these doors. Okay. So automatic. And this bin is an I assault like that. rifle. With this weapon, you can zoom Ooh. in on your target by squeezing the manual target. What's the manual target button? Hang on. Okay, that's. Okay. In this bin is. Yeah, shut target. up, minute, pal. With okay, weapon, so zoom in the left by squeezing the manual target trigger button. thing Try it out. is the manual target button. Because that's... Yeah, so the crosshairs there uh, kind of stay pretty close. Okay. Shut up, pal! For fuck's sake! With this right. weapon, you can zoom in on your Jesus target. Christ! Notice I'll do this it. this weapon requires a different caliber of ammunition than the two... <sighs> yeah, I guess so. Same rules apply. Whenever you're ready... Oh, it's one of these aims where basically he just squints a little bit. Right. Oh, God. This is going to be twitchy as fuck, isn't it? They've only... Give, have they given us less bullets? Ooh, ten. Nice. We're gonna make a marksman out of you yet, John. Now, this is one thing I don't like about the um, the GameCube control pad. We have to, like, the, there's a lot of travel on these buttons. And then they click at the bottom. But you have to really push the button almost all the way down before the gun fires. Yeah, so, look. See, I don't know if I can capture this on the camera. Look how far I have to push this down before it fires. Almost to the edge. Or almost right to the bottom. And it just doesn't feel good. Ooh, 
unlucky. That was almost a perfect. Yeah, score. almost. Okay, let's move if on. If we weren't using faulty fucking inaccurate control pads, although I'm sure that's not the game. I'm sure that's. Whenever you're ready. I'm sure it's not the control pad. That's just the way the buttons are mapped. In this bin, we have the sniper. Ooh, rifle. lovely. This allows you to zoom in extremely close in your target. So I'll be expecting a perfect. Yes, boss. Score. Now this sniper rifle better be good because it was one of the advertised features on the back of the box. So. In this bin. Yeah. All right, buddy. Rifle. Ooh, she's a peach. Um, how do we like zoom in? Surely, okay, cool. I was gonna say, surely we can zoom in more than that. Well, oh, there is zero recoil. I guess we've got to reload. Mm, reload animations, not bad considering the age of the game. That's a perfect score, John. Well the guns done. sound nice. Okay, let's move on. For the age, you know. All right, what have we got this bin? Or have I got a hand in all my toys now? You are now carrying all four weapons in your inventory. Okay. You can change weapons by using the control. Oh, I see. Pressing up and down on the control pad will quickly cycle through the weapons you're carrying. Um. Pressing left and right on the control pad will bring up an inventory screen, okay. allowing you to see what items you're it's carrying. Kind of cool. From here, you can select what you want by scrolling up and down and then pressing X. Gotcha. Notice that you have two inventory screens. One is for weapons and the other is for gotcha. items. The control pad will toggle between uh -huh. the two. Try this now. So, items of which we have none. Good. In but the next room, we have a shooting gallery. Weapons? Boards will pop okay, up so our fist is a weapon. On them. I like you'll that. You'll score one point for every bad guy you shoot, but you'll lose one point for every civilian you hit. The test is so, over don't shoot ten. everybody, is what in you're saying. In front of me, you can collect some new ammo. Okay. If you run out of ammo, come back here and we'll reset the course. Whenever you're ready, John. Yeah, okay, you say whenever I'm ready, but you're just going to bitch on at me, aren't you? Oh, 300 okay, rounds. Let's move on. Nice. At least I think that's 300 rounds. Can I, like, fiddle the screen? So I don't know how this is recording, but... Uh, game setting options... Okay, so the bottom of my screen is actually cut off, which is weird. Whenever you're ready, John. Yeah, cool story, bro. Um, yeah, I like the way that our fists are actually listed as an item. That's that's quite cute. Okay, let's move on. Look, you say whenever I'm ready, yet all you do is fucking harp on and whinge and moan. I thought he was going to tell... Whenever you're ready, John. Fucking dick. All right. Okay, the test will begin when you step into the... Yeah, I, I know how to do video games. Ugh. Oh, no, we have to... Oh, God. I, green is bad, I guess. Okay. Ugh. I wish... Oh, God, I wish I could explain how it feels to aim. Oh, no. And you have to... The trouble is you have to push the trigger down so far to actually, like, enable it. It's almost like the button's not working. Oh, dude, this is not fun. John, that brain hemorrhage has not done you any favours. I can tell you that, buddy. Oh, man. <laughs> this is going to be a shit show. More of a shit show than it actually is. Um, well, we, we, we <laughs> nothing. I mean, I think even in the movies, he was a better shot than this. He has very little recoil on the guns. Like, well done, John. That's a respectable is it? Okay, let's move on. Dude, that was terrible. I was literally like pulling the trigger with my fucking tongue. Can we not Maybe get more bullets? He told me I could like go and reset. The door is locked. You lied to me. Okay, let's. Move I trusted on. you, and you lied to me. You lying son of a bitch. Whenever you're ready. Oh, fuck John. you, pal. I don't trust anything that comes out of your mouth now. You lied to me. You said, hey, okay, you can have on. another go whenever you want. Because we're buddies. And we go way back. And I was there for you when you had your brain hemorrhage. But no. Brain hemorrhage that was uh, brought about by okay, standing John, on broken glass. You could put all your weapons into this bin by pressing I assume. on it. Somehow glass traveled up into his brain. I don't want to put my weapons Thanks. down. Okay, next up is the obstacle. Put them down very neatly. Let's see how agile you are. <laughs> yeah. Hey, remember the brain hemorrhage thing that I had? Okay, sure it'll be fine. This ladder by walking into it. At the top, you want to make your way across this beam. Some people find it easier by crawling along the uh -huh. To go prone, double tap the crouch. Wait, there's a crouch button? button? That's the fist button. Um, 
Oh, okay. Okay, I see. I see. Yes. So this is like rehabilitation. So I'm I'm guessing like glass got absorbed into our body through our feet and gave us a brain hemorrhage. And now they've basically gone from teaching us how to open doors to crawling across beams that may or may not end up with us. Okay, you've just performed an Ow. auto jump. Climb up the ladder and try it again. I just again. performed an Moving auto slowly jump. will allow you more control. How, how, how look. Okay, this guy's motor skills are all over the place. How the fuck did we just perform an auto jump? Like, okay, you did not explain to me anything about auto jumps, sir. I want to... I don't need to crawl on my belly like a bitch. There we go. Look at that. See? This brain hemorrhage hasn't slowed me down a bit. My my well feet done. still work. Okay, there's a crash mat down there. If you run off the edge of this platform, you will automatically jump. This will help you reach the mat, which will cushion your fall. Okay, so why didn't you tell me about that before, like, you let me auto-jump over that? You fucking spanner. I don't think you're my friend at all, actually, buddy. Ugh. Oh, that's nice. It's like a giant whoopee cushion. I approve. You can jump whenever you want to by pressing the oh, jump Oh, that's convenient. Button. Climb these steps by walking into them and jumping. Oh, my God. The GameCube control pad. It's so weird. Okay, so why is jump? Whoa, we can, well like, done. fucking vault up this. It's sometimes Ooh. easier to use the auto-jump. If you run off the edge of this platform, you will automatically. I feel like I'm playing Zelda. Try this now. <laughs> and again. <laughs> Those jumps. That that is floaty. That is weird. We've we've got a serious spring in our step. I will tell you that much. Boing. Hello, there, pal. Okay. Get across this gap by using the moving. Platform. Oh man. We're only right. We're only in the uh, tutorial. And nothing's going on, and we're already getting lag. There's already frame dro Ooh, fucking hell. Fra That's going to get annoying. There's already frame droppage going on. What the fuck? <laughs> if you... <laughs> okay. If we're having this much trouble, like, navigating this uh, assault course, <clears throat> rehabilitation, I'm sure, uh, I'm sure we're going to be massively successful when we come to the rescuing of hostages, you know. Okay, I think we're on the ledge. It's kind of hard to see. Yeah, look at that. We lost some frames there. Good. Now run down the uh, steps. Are you sure that's wise? Fucking hell! <laughs> you said run down the steps. We flew down the steps. Shit. You'll have to crouch to get under this. Uh, ladder. crouching. To yes. Crouch, tap the crouch. Okay. Now jump I over this block. I know how to crouch. God's sakes. Honestly. This gap is too small to crouch under, but you can get under it by going yep. prone. You've already prone. explained going prone. And okay, John, you beat the obstacle course. <laughs> Who crawls with his fists out like this? I mean, this guy wants some serious business. Talk about fighting around the world. Whenever you're ready, John. All right, buddy. You say whenever I'm ready, but then you rush me. John, let's try you out against some human opposition. Wait, what? In the next room, there are five instructors who have taken okay. cover. In this training section, you've got to make it to the exit without getting oh, shot. If you get shot. Return back to the beginning and we'll reset the course. However, if you shoot any of the instructors, they will be eliminated from the okay. course. Because we're dealing with real people here, John, we'll be using paintballs. Oh, good. Glad you... You'll find a gun and some ammo in I'm glad you bin. cleared that up, buddy. Oh, it actually is a paintball gun. you walk through these doors. <laughs> oh, man. You know what? That's... That's pretty cool. The course begins once Shut you up, pal. I'm enjoying my paintball. Um... Okay, right. Ugh. The course he signed up for this. All right, looks clear. All right, John, let's do this. Just remember, just like in the film that you're in once. Ooh. Hey, I just tagged you. Get the fuck out of here. Shame they didn't do the whole thing. Oh shit, we actually <laughs> we might run out of ammo. Um. Yeah, it's a shame they didn't do the whole Half-Life Opposing Force thing when uh, you get shot point-blank range in the training. As you can see, you are not dead. I love that. Um, oh, oh, hello. Are these guys asleep? I swear they're asleep. Or do they just know that John McClane, the special operative, is coming through? He's a bit slow, bless him. So they're just taking it easy on us. Oh, hello. Yep, we gun. We gun. Not bad, John. Not bad. Yeah, he, they're definitely taking it easy on old John here. Yeah, he's not as young as he used to be, bless him. With the glass and the brain, he's uh, he's he's suffering. You're dead. 
Go back to the start. <sighs> there was one left. There was one left, John. Hey, you, you can only blame his condition on that. We'll try again. Right, one second, guys. My phone is going off. Now the phone has been sorted. Let's go see if we can't get um, special agent John McLean uh, in a better state. God damn it! Go back to the start and we'll try it. Okay, let's try uh, it. Again. Hang on, we don't even get any more bullets. Uh, sorry, paintballs. So what's what's up with that? Like, what happens if we run out? Come on, dude. There we go. You're done. Okay, Special Agent John, let's do this, buddy. Come on, there we go. Right in the head. Yes. It's a little bit hard to tell, like, if you've actually hit them or not. But, I suppose it's not that bad. Alright, where's this other dick that was hiding over here? He... Congratulations, John. That's he, wasn't all. he wasn't taking it easy on me like everyone else. You know that I'm... Well, special yeah, needs ready, now. John. And he did not get. Sometimes you will encounter insurmountable odds in the line uh -huh. of duty, but being one of the good guys, you can even out these odds by using what I like to call hero time. Wait, what? This will give you faster reflexes than your opponents for a set period of time. Normally, you would earn hero points by doing good Wait, deeds, but for the purpose of this test, you'll be given some at the start. When you enter the next room, a group of instructors will attack you. Simply shoot all of them before they shoot okay. you. To trigger hero time, dirty deeds press your hero mode done. Button. You'll stay in this mode. Ooh, that's cheap, time. I guess. You can get some more paintballs from oh, this good. Bin. When you're ready, just step through the hero door. time. I like the way they clear up the fact that we're one of the good guys. When you're ready, just step <laughs> through the door. Oh. oh god. Okay. When so how do I use hero time? And is this an ability that we've acquired because of our brain hemorrhage? Okay. Three. Two, one, go. Um. Whoa. Okay, that was interesting. I like. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Like I'm not sure. Excellent. You took how that all works. Out. Let's try the next test. Does it like activate automatically? I don't know. Whenever you're ready, John. And there's more meat to this training mode than I thought. Let's test your throwing arm. In this bin, you'll find ten smoke grenades. Ten, in the you next say? Room, you'll find five bins. Five bins, ten. Two grenades, three bins. Throw a grenade into each of those bins. When throwing a grenade, pressing the fire button Whoops. will pull the pin out of the grenade. Releasing the fire button will throw the grenade. The longer you wait between pulling out the pin and releasing the grenade, the farther you will throw. I see. It. Okay, let's try. Uh, mate, <laughs> I'm running out of grenades, dude. Can I have... Oh, God. It's gassy in here. Okay, let's try. Yeah, I'm trying these grenades out. They seem to work pretty well. Although, I'm not sure what you've put in them. Okay, let's try. Uh, can I have some more grenades, please? Something's happened to mine. Oh. Okay, let's yeah, try. I need more nades, buddy. Oh, lovely. There is more nades. Okay, oh, let's it's try. riot gas. Okay. Well, we'll take the right gas. Uh, there we go. Oh man, this is weird, to say the least. Did that go in? I guess it did. It's always awkward when you got to ask if it's in yet. Come on, there we go. Oh my god. Oh, that didn't go in. We're on single digit frame rate right here. Yeah, uh, there. Damn, I don't even know where that grenade's going. Come on, John. I think that's in. No, how the fuck nuggets? I can't even see where the nade's going, to be honest. Right, let's try and arc that sucker in. Where did that go? Nope, that bounced off. Running out of nades, buddy. 
What about that? Hey! Okay. I think we can, like, aim directly at them. Is that a thing that we can do? No, we're chucking it way too hard. Ooh. Ooh. Yes! You on the last nade. Woo! Okay, let's move on. Yeah! yippee ki -yay, motherfucker. Welcome to the party, pal. Alright, what's in the box? Okay, John. Running in guns blazing isn't always the best uh -huh. way. Sometimes the subtle approach works no, better. The next exercise is to see how quiet oh, you shit. Can be. There are two ways for you to move. Dude, I'm not very quiet. Action or stealthily. Ooh. Pressing your stealth button will toggle between the two stealth modes. Stealth button? Try this now. What? What's the stealth button? Buddy. Good. And again. Good. Oh. Now when you're in stealth B. mode, you'll make less noise and are less likely to be seen. Okay. How does that work? Unfortunately, you'll have to move slower to be quiet. If you punch or shoot in stealth mode, you will automatically change to an action mode and your cover will be Shit. blown. In the next room, there are various instructors and cameras patrolling and keeping watch. You must get from here to the exit door without being okay. spotted. If you're spotted, return to the start and we'll try So... Again. Enter the room when you're ready. Can they, like, spot me? Um... If I'm in stealth mode? Nothing to see here, guys. Just a handicapped. I see you, McLean. Oh. You've been spotted, Gay. John. Come back to the start. Remember, sometimes it's best to. Whenever you're ready, John. Oh, this is gonna suck, monkey balls, isn't it? Sneak, stick, stick. Where the fuck nuggets has he gone, buddy? Where have we gone? Oh God. You can avoid. I see you, Who? McLean. But. Oh, this is going to be serious levels of ass, isn't it? Oh, this is going to be horrible. Whenever you're ready, John. Right, where is he? Can we... Yeah, because you can't, like, look around... Oh, I see you, McLean. You now. You've been spotted, John. Come back whenever you're ready, yeah. John. So, what way is he going? Oh, he's turning around. I see Fuck. So he just patrols up and down there. He doesn't actually spotted, go all John. the way around. Come back to the start. Uh, ready, man, this is going to be bullshit. I was going to say, this game's feeling okay, but then we get to this stealth... He goes around that corner. You can avoid the camera above by staying behind it. If you had a silenced pistol, you could also shoot it. A silenced pistol. Ah, one of them. One of those mythical... Silences. It's important Ooh. to always scout out the area before making. Yeah, how do we duck behind the boxes and sidestep to look around without being spotted? Sidestep. How do we? How do we sidestep? Okay, let's not try and overcomplicate things. Let's just stay behind this guy. This guy has no idea we're here. But again, I think he's just being kind. Like John is a bit retarded. Oh, you. You. like how? You've been spotted, John. Come back to the start. Do we? No, 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 no way. Come the fuck. Where's that prick gone? I'm gonna make him swallow his own teeth. You're a knob. You know that, pal. All right, one last go, because this is doing my fucking head in. I hate stealth mechanics Whenever you're ready, in games John. when they're bad. Right. How do we? Ah. Oh, Fucking right. Okay, I don't know how we avoided that, but we did. Again, I think he's being very kind to us. You can avoid the camera above by staying behind. Yeah. If you had a silenced pistol. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know, we know, we know the deets, mate. Oh, put that away. Put your fists away, it's buddy. It's important to always scout out the area before making. Yeah, don't worry about it. Duck behind the boxes and sides. The frame rate on this game, I have to say, is terrible. Like that's one thing that's constantly oh god screwing me over at the moment like you i don't know if you can see it on the camera but like when we go around this corner for instance it chugs and what's concerning is nothing's happening yet where is that guy i see what? you playing are you You've kidding me John. come back to you the can start. see me through Oh, that's some, some serious grade bullshit there. Oh. Like. You fucking knob end. Hey, what do you think of that? 
Yeah, your wife won't think you're so handsome now, will she? Dick. <sighs> Knob. And you, you fucked me over once as well. Don't you aim that fucking paintball at me, boy. Stick it up your ass. <sighs> Be shit in purple for a week. Oh, man. Whenever you're yeah, ready. Yeah, whenever we're ready. Cool. Let's go. Thing is, we can't, like, peek out. Turn around, you numpty. Okay, he actually turns around that way. That's good. Yeah, it's just the guy in the dark corridor is going to be a dick. Like, you can avoid dick. the camera above by staying behind it. If you had a silenced pistol, you could also yeah, shoot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm actually surprised the camera didn't see us due to bullshit reasons. Yeah, you can sidestep like it's a boss. To always scout out the area before. You can actually you sidestep. Duck behind the box quicker. And sidestep to look around without being spotted. Quicker than we can actually move forward. So actually, quicker to go that. Quicker to move like that. Right now, it hasn't mentioned. I see you, McLean. <sighs> You've been spotted, John. Come back to the start. You know, what, buddy. Fuck your training course. If there are any places in this game where we have to be where, mandatory, where it's mandatory to be um, stealthy, we're, we're straight up fucked. We've been recording for half an hour. Man, you look so awful. do you, buddy. A little white wine and some food, Shit. and then a night at the opera. Welcome back. If you're just joining us, I'm Dick Thornburg, <laughs> reporting live for HEN, the Hollywood Entertainment Network, where show business is your business. I did. It's a beautiful Calm day down. in Los Angeles, and I can see the whole city from atop the Townsend <laughs> Art Museum. Art patrons, city officials, and various other important LA personalities have gathered to witness this occasion. <laughs> Piet Gruber, the son of the notorious criminal Hans oh. Gruber, has returned to the city where his father met his demise. Piet, however, is here to return a painting recovered from one of his South American expeditions. Sure is. Gruber maintains Gruber. that this generous gesture is not a way to clear his family name, but an act of conscious art uh -huh. preservation. Sure, Dick. Gruber. Well, we're here at the presentation ceremony, which is just about to begin. <laughs> Townsend oh. curator Christoph von Leben is getting <laughs> ready to names. speak to this excited crowd. Look at my Lucy. First day on the job, following in her old man's footsteps. Thank you all for joining us today as we return this wonderful work to its rightful place <laughs> in the Townsend oh, this is Art great. Museum. We've waited a long time to retrieve this piece, and we are so lucky that Mr. Piet Gruber rediscovered the Jacques through his dealings in South America. Yeah. We'll let Mr. Gruber do the honors as he unveils the shock and hands it over to me as Townsend curator. Ah, I see. Okay, Buzz, get some shots of the guests. The more skin, the better, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Wait a sec. Isn't that the fitness instructor guy over there? Mm, frontier something or another. The guy with Gruber. It is with great pleasure that I give to you the Jacques masterpiece, Lakeside. What have you got behind your, your, your back I've there, I've been buddy. assured by Mr. Von Leben that it will be rehung in its proper place and very well protected. Sure you have. But what about the thief that stole it? How were you able to obtain the painting so easily? We are very close to the perpetrator of the crime. I can assure you that the culprit will be brought to justice. There's Lucy. What? Um, what the hell is that? Hey, buds, are you getting this? Gunshots, Lucy. Uh, everyone remain calm. There's, there's nothing to be alarmed about. And I always thought art was boring. This is Dick Thornburg live, and what started out as a lovely oh, summer Dick, day you and your nonsense. into a maelstrom of blood and bullets. Buzz, are you getting this? I am risking my life here. Wait, so. Okay, I don't, I don't want to pick holes in the plot or anything like that, because, you know, I mean, that's silly. And we've already had enough of Dick's nonsense. Avoid civilian casualties. Rescue Lucy. Oh so, I'm guessing they uh, started a ruse, Mr. Gruber started a ruse, uh, a distraction, if you will, by bringing this painting into this art museum, this Townsend place, 
And whilst they had the big how you do, they decided that they were going to sneak some other people in the back door and steal everything. Well, says camera crews and everything. Okay, cool. I like it. God, how could this happen? Um, this is hey, McLean. Fun, John. You get called uh, in? yeah, y yes, we we got called in. Yeah, we totally just didn't s turn up waving a gun around. Um, oh fuck. Man, we just need some details from you. What's need to be name? careful. Um, oh my god, my name is Claudia Sherman. Oh my god. I'm from the valley. Oh god. Are you okay? Are you injured? I was like so scared. Oh my god. I thought I was like. A Total goner. Jesus. Okay, we'll have a medic look after you when you get down the hill. Like, I'm so sure you should really be careful in there. We're professionals, man. Yeah, we'll I think... I, oh, I, know, I like the auto loader. Yeah, I think I just got AIDS talking to her. John, Definitely lost some brain cells. What the hell are you doing here? Well, my daughter's here. So, you know. yippee ki -yay, motherfucker. Welcome to the party, pal. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Oh, it's too good. <laughs> it's too good. I can't look at your face. I'm sorry. Oh, what about you? Oh, <laughs> look at this gun. He's got, <laughs> He's got the world's smallest gun. I'm, well, that's that's maybe a little bit personal, but <laughs> look. <laughs> All right. All right. Come on, buddy. Let's just let's, let's kick some ass. Let's get this door open. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? Stretch neck. Oh, Jesus. Uh, yeah, so, uh, are we, are we get anything done here, buddy? Or... Do you know what you're doing with that thing? Do you have any idea what you're doing? Probably not. Alright, well, I don't think we're going in that way. So, you know. Um, hmm... Alright, well, I guess we have to go in that way. Can we destroy the- Oh, we can destroy, like, priceless artifacts. Okay, when we've got the gun out, we can actually move at a decent speed. That's good to know. So, like, okay. Do we talk to these idiots? Uber killed some good men today. Don't wait for an excuse to kill him. Ooh! Wait. I'm sorry, I, I didn't- I didn't- <laughs> He was looking at me funny! He was threatening. Failed to avoid non-hostile casualties. Oh my god! Hey, that was an accident, man. This is gonna be fun. John. Hey, McLean, you get called in. Man, we just need some details. That was an from accident. Do I have to talk to these guys? What the hell are you doing here? Can I talk to these Looking guys? Ah, daughter. okay. Lucy's here. Yes, sir. It was her first assignment. <laughs> it seems she surprised the robbers. John, we've not heard anything from my people in <laughs> the there. Fuck? Al, I know my Lucy's alive in there. <laughs> when the alarm got tripped, seems they panicked. They grabbed a group of hostages and sealed themselves. All right, we'll sort this We're out. Cutting through now. So what you got in mind, John? Wave this around. I don't know if being Lucy's father makes it a good thing for you to be here. <laughs> Do you not feel threatened, my friend? Do you not feel slightly concerned? This guy look look. This motherfucker looks like Wesker. That's what I plan to do in there, pal. Oh, hang on. How did? Oh, they didn't explain that. Are you sure you should be turning up on duty today, buddy? Are you sure there's nothing wrong with you? Is that brain hemorrhage kicking in again? Is that why we retired? I don't know. Uh, anyway. Look, Al, I'm not leaving. Now, I'm not in uniform, so if I get spotted, I'll just make like I was a guest who got lost. Oh, yeah. You look like a real art lover, McLean. <laughs> well, I've always been partial to the odd comic book. Sir, we're in. McLean. Don't try to stop me, Al. I was just going to wish yeah, you Yeah, don't try and stop me, pal. We'll be on the radio. I don't think I could put this any further in his face if I try. Oh, hang on, hang on. Maybe we can. Maybe we can. Let's. Eh. There we go. <laughs> Literally stick the gun up his nose. <laughs> what the fuck? This is great. This is fucking great. Oh, you're right, dude. <laughs> you used the whole bottle of gas on that thing? <laughs> oh, fucking no. We got another Wesker. Alright. Welcome to the party, pal. Oop. <sighs> Looks like this place is clear. Um, mm. Ooh, fuck. Can we take a pamphlet? Oh shit. Oh, hello! Where did you come from? Seriously? You're just gonna sneak up on me like that? Nah, I'm okay. Of course I'm here. Wow. This gun is very ineffective. Um, unless... 
Unless you get lucky, I guess. I bet we can pick the Plemento out of an olive for this thing. Holy shit. Oh, fuck me. Hey, pal. That was a scary sight to run into. Thank God for this autoloader. Can I have another gun, please? This one's a bit crap. Have we got anything in here? We've got medkits. Oh, shit. I guess uh, we can use the medkits from our inventory. I guess we have 85 health as well, so... These are important things that training did not cover. Hey, oh. We got company. Oh, hey. I thought you were talking to me. Whispering sweet nothings into my ear. Mmm. With your sexy, silky voice. Damn, son. Oh, fuck. I don't know why I was stuck on that. Uh-oh. Come on, pal. There we go. yippee ki motherfucker. Oh, shit. You guys are everywhere. What kind of operation is this? Did you not die? What the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck? Well, that was awful. Mate, you ain't getting any Oscars for that, I'm telling you. Alright. Okay, so these are just enemy rooms, basically. Rooms that just exist solely to have enemies. Oh, we can open doors. That's good. Yes, we can open doors. We, we were thoroughly um, instructed. So, guess you weren't expecting this one. I guess. That was a copy. Guess you weren't expecting that, were you, pal? Yeah, we have been thoroughly instructed on uh, opening doors. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. Oh, that's a bit better. Ooh, fuck. Well, scumbag. Almost shot the civvy. Hello, right pal. We have the 9mm. Knock, knock. I wouldn't use those as cover. What am I using as cover? What's going on? I wouldn't just stand out in the open like that either, but, you know, what do I know? Fuck. Come on, pal. There was like a weird auto-aim thing, which I usually don't like, but it kind of works alright, actually. I'm right, almost dead, which isn't great, let's be honest. Being dead is the opposite of what we want. Oh, fuck. Hello. But because of the auto-aim, it's very hard to get, like, headshots or anything. But then, like, if I'm being honest with you, I don't think I care about getting headshots. That is not the McLean way. Oh, we got two revolvers. Apparently. Medkits don't restore all of our health. We can only carry one? Oh, that's more like it. That's the shit. Alright, let's go fuck someone's day up. Uh, or we could. Now, even for the time, this game is ugly, man. This looks like shit. Like, everything's so bland. There's no textures. The sky looks like something out of The Simpsons. Oof. Oofed. Alright, well, um... Hey, the water's not terrible. Can we, like, go down here? Ugh. Oh, there's stairs there. Whoa, we got a sniper rifle. Is that wise? Ooh, swallowed that fucker. Well, well, well. I guess it's true where there's shit, there's flies. <laughs> Definitely flies on this. Fucking hell. Well, there's shit, there's flies. <laughs> oh, I love it. Alright, give me them. You alright there, pal? Great. The best footage we've had in ages. Police massacres, foreign art benefactors. Police massacres? What are you talking about, pal? Over there! I am death, come for thee. How do we reload again? He's can't here. remember. He's here! Nothing gets past you, does it, buddy? Hiding behind the door like that, you dick. What do you think he's doing? You silly little sausage. Oh, hello! Um. Oh, we were supposed to rescue Von Laban. Okay. I thought we were trying to rescue our daughter. Now, how do we reload? Uh, oh yeah. You alright there, Mr. Vaughn? Ooh, fucking hell. There we go. We've got some fucking firepower now. Out of the way. You don't want that lovely suit of yours to get blood on it. You know, I used to have a paintball gun that used to fire paintballs that colour. 
Oh shit. Oh the frame rate though. Hello pal. It was either gonna be me or cancer. <laughs> Cause he's smoking, I guess. Alright, evening lads. This is my house. Oh fuck. Not a fan of the stock sound effect of this uh, Uzi, but whatever. Ooh. It is quite a fun weapon. Do, can we have two of these? Oh, hello. I just shot your clone behind you. Oh, God. That's definitely a helicopter. Definitely getting away. Definitely reloading. Definitely dead. Well. Try and stay alive, John. Now, now, guys, that's some life advice, okay? If you take anything away from anything I've ever said in my life, try and stay alive, guys. Best advice you're ever gonna hear. Oh my God! How could this? Wait, happen? we go all the way back if we. This is gonna be fun, John. We go all the way back. Like what? But 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 that's fucking shit. All right, well, I ain't gonna go through that again. Um, yeah, it's all right, I suppose. It's kind of better than I thought it would be. Uh, it, I mean, okay, let's take that back. Let's think about this. It's shit. It's absolute rancid shit. But I don't know. It was it was enjoyable, but. I don't think that I could realistically sit down and play it and enjoy it. I mean, the, the storyline was gripping. Absolutely phenomenal stuff. You know, Shakespeare, even. But the graphics uh, and the sound design is what really lets it down, you know. You know. Um, yeah. I, I wouldn't go as far as saying it's a turd, though. I think it's like one of those games that... I don't know. If you've got a load of mates around and some beer... It might be fun throwing on and having a laugh, but I don't know if anyone's actually ever completed this game. Might actually, <laughs> I mean, fuck, who the fuck could get through that? Oh, The weapons, like, everything about it is just so generic and bland. It really looks like a high-resolution um, N64 game, really. Sure as shit, doesn't look like a decent GameCube game. I get the feeling this was made on a shoestring budget. He just wanted to fart something out. And, uh, yeah, I guess he did. Definition of shovelware. And the controls are so awkward as well. Like, um, yeah, the C-stick. I just don't like it. The way everything's kind of just stuck. There's no, like, fine aiming. And the way they've, they've, they shouldn't really have uh, mapped the, uh, the fire button to this uh, really well I suppose I kind of had to but the, you should have had to almost bottom it out like I think just a little twitch of the R button would have done would have gone a long way into improving the uh, the way the game feels also there's no rumble at least I didn't notice any rumble maybe it's just very very um minute yeah well okay well that's one that's one game that's been sitting on my shelf for about a thousand years I well, I can see why the reviews um, slated this. I could only assume that this was in development for another for another console. Maybe it was for the N64. And they just ported it over to the Cube. And I guess PlayStation 2 and a few other things. Because it looks like ass. I mean, there's some very nice looking GameCube games and original Xbox games. Even like PlayStation uh, 2 games. But yeah, there's no animation or anything. Hmm. Very much a budget release. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. So, I hope you've enjoyed this look at uh, Die Hard Vendetta. I've, well, yeah, I've enjoyed it, but I'm never going to touch it again. So, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time. <laughs>